Chris, I feel like you have someone blocked. Like you have someone's communication literally blocked. I'm hearing, I'm locked up. They won't let me out. That's that Akon song, I think. Um, actually, I don't want to use this deck. I want to use this one. Someone could be um, deaf here. I feel like I'm hearing, I'm hearing something about sign language. Like the use of sign language. I'm also getting something here about twins. Like you can tell that you can tell, but you can tell them apart. Taurus. What's going on for Taurus this month of May in general? Tor oh, hi, Taurus. It's going to be your general reading for this month of May. Um, we're not doing a spread. We're just freestyling it. Whatever comes out, comes out. This could be your message. It could not be. We going to see. What's going on for Taurus this month of May? I feel like you're figuring something out or you're figuring somebody out, Taurus. Um, I feel like you're figuring out how somebody actually works, like the way that like they're not as like stupid as you think. Um, someone actually operates on a whole different level. The Fool card. I feel like Taurus, either you're planning, you're plotting something, like you're scheming or somebody else is scheming. I feel like you're conspiring against someone or someone is conspiring against you. The Fool. But I feel like someone here is the topic of discussion. It's like someone's favorite topic when as soon as they open their mouth, let me talk about Taurus or let me talk about this earth sign, this this Virgo or this Capricorn. As soon as I wake up, as soon as I wipe the crust out of my eyes, oh my God, Capricorn, like, or oh my God, Taurus. The full king of pentacles. It's like bright and early. The high priestess. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Some interesting. The full king of pentacles and the high priestess. The five of swords let me just pull cards for right now and then i'm gonna read it five of five of swords six of swords and the judgment card the fool king of pentacles i feel like if someone's lying towards they're gonna stick to this lie like they're they're never gonna fold on it like they're never gonna forget it this person understands that if you're gonna tell a lie you need to stick to it you need to stick with this lie for the rest of your life even even formulate a whole background story around it just to solidify it but this lie is heavily like it's it's not going nowhere they're, they will never be honest about this specific thing whatever it is i feel like you know they're lying maybe they know that you know they're lying about something they may twist their words a little bit or twist the truth bend it a little bit tell a little white lie but i feel like you've heard them say this before I feel like someone, I don't know what's going on with all these signs dealing with somebody overly secretive. We got that in Aries reading and Pisces. No, it was just, it, it was just Aries and it was Aquarius' reading where there was an overly secretive person. Um, the Fool, King of Pentacles, the High Priestess, Five of Swords, and the Six of Swords. What's the King of Pentacles, High Priestess, King of Pentacles, Eight of Pentacles? Why am I getting this conspiring energy? Who's conspiring against who? Why? I feel like Taurus, someone wants to make sure that you do not reach something, like a goal that you're after. That's why someone's conspiring against you. Like they want the opposite effect to happen. So let's say you want to succeed. They want you to fail. You want to get promoted. They want you to get demoted. Matter of fact, go, go to the unemployment office right now. Like you're about to get fired. Like... Um, that's what they want. I'm not saying that's what's happening. I'm not saying that's what's happening. That's what they want. I feel like there's somebody higher up or in a better position, maybe higher status, that likes you, and this person is lower than them. So the person that likes you, their ranking is higher. They have more pull or they have more reach. Their effect is stronger than whoever it is that doesn't like you. So it's like even if this person that doesn't like you or wants you to fail, even if they do something, the person that's higher than them that does like you can reverse it because they just have that power. I feel like there's someone that wants you to go in business with them, but I'm getting there's like some kind of hater in the mix here that doesn't want you to succeed at all. King of Pentacles, High Priestess, Five of Swords, Six of Swords, and the Judgment card. I'm also getting someone at your job or maybe someone, someone in regards to the way that you make money. Maybe you make money with this person. Whatever relation they have to you, they're trying to impress you. But it specifically has to do with like at your job, if you're employed by someone else or um, for some of you, if you make music. Um, for some of you, if you're employed by yourself, then there's somebody in the business that you're in, like the same business that wants to impress you. They want to work with you, collaborate. King of Pentacles, High Priestess, Five of Swords, Six of Swords, and the Judgment card. I feel like Taurus, whatever this is that someone's trying to get over on you, you need to defend it. Like stick, stay, stick, 
Stick to your guns, stand your ground with something. I don't know if they're trying to relocate you or move you. Like, let's say, I'm gonna just use the example of if you guys are employed by someone else because it's the easiest example to use. They're gonna move you from one place to another because, I don't know, someone just feels like moving you just to be an asshole. You have to stick to your ground. Uh, stand your ground, I mean. King of Pentacles, High Priestess, Five of Swords, Six of Swords. Like, don't let them do this because there's an underlying reason why they're doing it and it's malicious. They don't have good intentions for you. They're doing this to make you make life far, make life harder for for you. What is this king of what is this high priestess here? For Taurus. I also feel like an ex could keep dialing you, like drunk dialing you or something. Page of Wands. I don't know why. Okay, what's this five of swords here? I don't know why. I feel like someone's gonna do something shady to you, but they want you to forget it just as fast. The moon card. You think someone's gonna show you like a magic trick or something? the moon the five of swords the high priestess but it's like they're gonna do something but they want you to co like they want you to forget it like it's like they want you they want to coerce you into doing something but they don't want you to real like even if you realize what they're doing they want you to not know that they're doing it like they want to kind of trick you even though you're caught on and even if you did catch on they want you to forget so they can do it again or something like that some stupid shit like that king of pentacles high priestess five of swords the moon and the page of wands so i feel like someone's gonna try the same tactic again and it's not gonna work. I don't know what this is. I feel like they're trying to confuse you. What five of swords? It could be someone that you work with that's like trying to sabotage you or your money. King of, King of Cups. I don't know. I feel like someone's gonna excuse you to something or excuse you somewhere. Like yeah, come into my office or something like that. I want to speak to you. King of Cups, Five of Swords. What's this High Priestess? The Chariot. chariot high priestess i don't know i keep getting like as soon as someone tells you something some kind of information or some kind of secret or whatever or as soon as someone does something to you they want you to forget that they said it or they want you to forget that they tried to do something like they don't want you to catch on but your intuition is going to catch on to it really quick it could be a cancer someone could literally be lying on your name the chariot high priestess five of swords the moon is this what's this five of swords here i also feel like taurus because you kept something a secret and you were looking out for someone they're about to look out for you in an even bigger way like you kept your mouth shut in a situation and that was the best thing that you could have ever done because this person's about to bless you because you could have ruined their life or you could have ruined their good name or their image or gotten them fired or whatever this is you could you could have done something grimy but you didn't like, with what you had, you could have really ruined lives or done something crazy, but you chose not to. That was a good decision to keep it to yourself. It was not favorable for you to open your mouth and speak about it. Because I feel like someone else would have talked about you or it would have turned, it would have flipped back in your face. Like, it would not have gone the way you expected. High Priestess, King of Cups, Five of Swords. I feel like now that you've kept this secret, this gives someone the opportunity to truly to truly get to know you or truly like trust you, believe you or something like that. Three of Cups. Something is very opportune for you and it's coming up. It could literally be a trust. Some of you guys could be a trust fund baby or something, but there's some kind of opportunity here and it's because you're keeping something private or a secret. Three of Cups. The High Priestess, Five of Swords. Let me pull uh, some gypsy cards because I feel like this will give me better clarity into what this is i feel like somebody was trying to trip you up or, or, or trick you like there was something deceitful going on i just don't know what this is what's the five of swords and the moon card i feel like someone caught i don't know it's like someone caught you some it's like someone caught you doing something or they caught you being somewhere that you should not have been or they caught you being with someone that you should not have been with you're gonna get away with it because i feel like the person that caught you is, is the type of person to be like, yeah, I didn't see nothing, I ain't seen nothing. Like, I ain't see shit. Cause cause being nosy gets your gets your ass murked, yo. Like you you got it. Sometimes you gotta I ain't see nothing. Cause if you did see something, you ain't gonna have no eyes to see later on to confess. Like this person is that kind of person. I ain't see nothing, I ain't say nothing. They saw it, they ain't gonna say nothing. They gonna mind their business. They're gonna mind their business. It could be one of your friends. They've been caught on, but they ain't say nothing because they not that person to snitch or be like, Yeah, I saw that run their mouth. They don't do that. 
this person could be from the streets they know how it works if you run your mouth you you, you mess around and get hurt marked even if it's not even that serious of a situation this person just kind of goes by street smart i didn't see anything you was with who last night i wow i would have never guessed i didn't know i still don't know i don't know who that person i don't know what you're talking about so if you're wondering if this person's gonna keep your secret they are gonna keep it and it could be because this person can easily forget a secret or they're that kind of person where it's like yeah why am i gonna run my mouth kiss and tell i don't do that that's stupid that's immature i don't do that like they don't do that this person is someone that you can trust i feel like this, i'm getting something here about a serial number a, a serial number on a serial box or on a car something the vin number like making sure that something is secured like all your pa all your passwords or devices or something is connected financially or stably um but yeah if you're wondering if someone's gonna keep this secret they can keep a secret for you they they can hold it down for you like they're not gonna tell anybody you don't gotta lie to this person or like they gonna forget about it anyways same same day you tell them next day they gonna forget they're not gonna remember they or they gonna act like they don't stay and see nothing they, they they're good at pretending they're they're on your side servant yeah this person's a good actress servant widower also this person is so good at hiding stuff you would never know that they knew something like wow you knew this the whole time and you had like i've been seeing you around like this person and that person and you've been acting like you ain't know but you knew the whole time widower money Yeah, somebody don't do that. They don't they don't snitch. They will keep your secrets private. Like they they're going to take it to the grave with them cuz it's not their secret to tell like they understand the code or something like they they get it. They don't there's no reason for them to snitch. So if you're wondering about one of your friends, yeah, they're safe. You can trust them. Servant widower money frivolity. I feel like this person could be doing you a favor cuz you did something for them. Or, they're, or you're doing them a favor because they did something for you. So it's kind of like an exchange, like a follow-up like follow or follow-back. Like, I'm going to do this in exchange for this, but you got you to you promise me your silence. That's it. Scholar. Yeah, I really feel like this person is like, I ain't seen nothing, I ain't saying nothing. This person's mad smart. Because I feel like if they did happen to see something, they know what would happen if they said they saw something. They know it would not work out for them. Like, I feel like... If this is a secret that they're keeping for you, they would incriminate themselves as well in telling the secret. So there's no point in lying or there's no point in snitching or going back because I feel like someone in this situation could ruin their life more if they were to open their mouth. Like, what what do, what do good would it do to you to open your mouth and say that you saw something or say whatever? You might as well protect this. I know you are this way anyways, but you might as well because it's not going to be good if you don't. Because I don't know, this is like someone protecting someone's secret because someone knows something worse about them y'all are y'all both have a moral like a moral code of like yeah i'm not gonna tell nobody i'm not gonna say anything because if you tell my secret i got worse dirt on you i'm not that kind of person but you wouldn't want that getting out now would you <laughs> um so it's like y'all what i don't know this is a friend group all y'all keeping each other's secrets like becky daniel got a boyfriend and then daniel boyfriend over here sleeping with becky cousin sister and then but 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 Becky cousin's sister can't even snitch to Daniel boyfriend like yo I'm sleeping with XYZ because Daniel boyfriend knows something about Becky or some I don't know somebody knows something about somebody there's a whole bunch of secrecy here it's best off if everybody keep their mouth shut because it's gonna get real messy if somebody decide to blabber it out page of swords yeah keep 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 it quiet keep it on the hush because I feel like if you snitch, what good is it going to do for you or anyone involved? You're going to be hurting yourself in the process or it's not going to do anything. Page of Swords, the sun. What's the Page of Swords in the sun for Taurus? Yeah, I feel like make a little game out of it. Make it fun for yourself. If you're, if you're doing something, make it fun. It's a little difficult. Make it fun for yourself. Make it entertaining. Page of Swords, the sun, four swords. Um, let me let me let me get back to the kipper i mean to the gypsy because i feel like there's another message here tell me more for taurus in general taurus in general this could have to do with money you know it's smart to not tell nobody how much money you have because if you do like it's not going to end up well like it's better just to not say anything in this situation honestly it's better for everyone to keep their mouth shut here surprise 
consolation yeah i feel like it's just people are paying you for something it's a surprise surprise consolation what is this for Taurus? surprise consolation i'm getting something here about like a video shoot someone's inviting you to something young woman it's a surprise that you don't expect like maybe surprise consolation young woman I don't know, I feel like it's a surprise how far this young woman has gotten or something. Like, it's something that you don't expect. I don't know what this is talking about, but surprise, consolation, young woman. What is this for a Taurus? You could be dealing with an Aries or be an Aries rising, sun or moon, sweetheart. I don't know, I feel like I feel like there's like a little gift here from God or something. Like, you didn't expect someone to be such an angel or such a sweetheart in your life or, or such a blessing in your life. Um, you didn't expect for 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 you to be repaid back like like this like the way someone's protecting you or wh whatever someone's doing for you it's very like it's from the heart there's no ill will or bad intentions surrounding it like someone's heart is just pure they're purely doing this just to do it surprise consolation young woman and sweetheart what is this for taurus haughtiness find what let me find out that the truth comes out hold on a minute young woman sweetheart haughtiness i don't know Taurus. what is this haughtiness card because i'm getting a message here now what is this haughtiness card for taurus in the situation mm, okay three of swords and the three of wands What's this three of swords and the three of wands and the ten of wands? I feel like someone, something does not even belong to someone, but they're out here flaunting it like it's theirs. I don't know what this is, though. Three of swords, three of wands, ten of wands. I don't know, Taurus. I just feel like you have something on somebody and they think they have something on you. Maybe they don't know that you have something worse on them. Like, maybe this person does not know that you know something sweetheart haughtiness three of swords three of wands ten of wands you could be forgiving someone from the past as well someone that it took a lot a lot of time to forget and forgive could be an aries um i don't know i feel like this person has pro projection issues they project their issues onto other people a lot i also feel like someone could be very forgetful i don't know i don't know i'm getting a lot of messages towards but um that's all I have for you. I hope this reading resonated. I hope you I hope it helped you in some way and I'll see you in your next reading. Bye.